Okay, show me how we install the Gobius Pro. It's so simple. Firstly, you need to choose where you wish to measure the tank level. We want to measure the tank when it's close to empty, so we will choose the bottom part of the tank. Make sure you measure the vertical sides, not the undersides or the top. So if we want to measure when the tank is full, we place it on the top vertical part. You've got it. Give yourself at least 35 millimetres from the edges. If the tank is cold, less than 20 degrees Celsius, use the heat gun to warm up the surface. Or you could use your hairdryer on max. Use the supplied cleaning cloth to clean the tank. Take the Gobius Pro and peel off the protective paper to reveal the self-adhesive pad and firmly push the sensor onto the tank for about five seconds. You should then wait 10 minutes before proceeding. Seems simple enough. And then you just open up the app on your phone, right? Right. Download the free app from the App Store, then the guide walks you through the installation process. We connect the power source by wiring the red cable to live and the black cable to neutral. So how do we start the relay switch to start the refill or connect the buzzer or light? If we want the Gobius Pro to activate when the level is rising, an upper level alarm, then we join together the red and green wires. If we want it to activate on the way down, then we join the red and yellow wires together instead. So now we have power and have connected our Gobius Pro, how do we configure it? Once the mobile device and the Gobius Pro automatically connect, we can configure the sensor by giving it a name. Let's call this Tank A. We choose the fluid contents. How often we would like to take a reading from every 10 seconds to every 48 hours. Select the tank material. Then we simply calibrate it by telling the app if the tank is full or empty. Click Next and the Gobius works its magic and calibrates. All done, Max. Fantastic. Let's go for lunch. I'm starving. Look, the Gobius says I'm empty. <laughs> it would read empty if you held it against your head as well, Max. Yeah.